Shalom. The question I received today was an interesting one. It says, what was the worst war that Israel has fought in and why? Uh, this is a fascinating question uh, because it depends on what you mean by how you measure worst, right? Is worst meaning the, how long it lasted, how many people died? But I'm going to take a stab at it and say the 1973 Yom Kippur War was the worst war because it was the only war we were completely and totally unprepared for. Intelligence reports had come into Prime Minister Golda Meir and had told her that although troops were massing on Israel borders, it was nothing more than an exercise or an act of intimidation. The Arab countries had no intention whatsoever of going to war. So when Yom Kippur came about in 1973, the last thing that Golda Meir was expecting or anybody really in Israel was expecting, except for a few individuals who had screamed and yelled at the warnings that this is actually going to be a war, was an Arab invasion. And the Arab invasion came and we were completely unprepared and we lost thousands of soldiers, unfortunately, and it kills to say it, but we lost thousands of soldiers and it took us a couple of weeks to get our, our bearings and get our grounding in war until we were able to push back the Arab attack and then eventually win the war. But that was most probably, if you understand what I'm saying here in terms of the effect and the damages, that was probably the worst war that Israel was in.